The process of designing a flight simulator is very involved, um, includes quite a team of uh, engineers. You would bring in mechanical engineers and electrical engineers and software engineers and systems engineers. Um, so it really is a team of, of folks that come together uh, with their exper expertise and experience to design a flight simulator. Um, it's essentially, the good thing with a simulator is that we could leverage from the design of the aircraft itself. Uh, you start with laying out the architecture. What are all the components that I'm going to need to uh, allow this system to communicate? Uh, so once you identify all the various components, uh, you would then, you know, like I said, lay out your architecture and figure out, okay, this system needs to talk to this system. How are these two going to talk? What kind of an interface uh, should we design to allow these two to talk? And then you start considering things like, is it time efficient? So let's just, as an example, take a visual system. It's essential that when I pull on the joystick that I see the aircraft lift up uh, as, as you really would see in the real, real world. So time is of, a, of you know, critical importance. So you would want to design a system that's capable of uh, supporting you know, time efficient data going back and forth between the two. Um, so it really, it takes, it, it's probably about a, a, a year process, if you will, to lay out and design hardware and software for a flight simulator. Um, but it is one that's very interesting and, and a lot of fun, quite honestly.